Hello friends, welcome to my channel Data Making. In this video, I am going to give you a little surprise for you. Okay, let's start the video. Okay, so this is my uh, 200th video in my channel Data Making. Okay, I would like to thank you every one of you who is supporting me continuously and encouraging me. Uh, thank you so much, friend. So in this video, I thought of what I will make. Okay, so uh, many requests from uh, 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 subscribers as well as friends like uh, do you have a video tutorial for uh, spark or PySpark or very specific to data frame or do you have uh, 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 videos for Apache Kafka tutorial and Python tutorial there are many requests coming right so I thought I will actually walk through my uh, channel playlist okay so I organized all the videos this 200 videos uh, almost 199 video this is going to be a 200th video so all this video I organized as a playlist. Okay, I'll just walk through a few of the uh, uh, few of the uh, playlist where you can actually go and explore and uh, learn the technologies in big data and you can get a job uh, very easily. Okay, so let's start. So okay, so first thing is uh, when you want to learn big data, right? Or you are probably uh, working in big data, right? If you want to uh, explore uh, new components in the big data, okay? So being Hadoop or Spark. Or any NoSQL no database like MongoDB or Cassandra, you need an environment, right? So I have videos for building up the environment as well as I build the environment like the virtual machine which contains Spark and Hadoop and some of the big data technologies, right? So I made a playlist how to set up that virtual machine and use that virtual machine. So that is available in the part of this playlist, free Spark and Hadoop virtual machine playlist. You can just go and explore it. Okay, next thing is, so I have a, a very good response for uh, this playlist, which is a PySpark 101 tutorial with complete hands on. Okay, so uh, I actually, this is the playlist I extensively started with uh, uh, till now 26 uh, videos have been done on this PySpark tutorial. So it's purely completely hands on uh, uh, tutorial I have. I would request people who are starting by uh, PySpark, you can just uh, start with this. Okay. Uh, so, uh, so you can think, you can ask me, okay, so how do I start uh, either PySpark or Spark with Scala? So before getting into any uh, basic knowledge of Spark. Okay, so I made uh, uh, two playlists on this uh, Apache Spark tutorial for beginners using Scala as well as Python. Okay, so, so this is uh, basically using uh, Scala. Uh, so this playlist has 10 videos. You can just go and explore the basic concepts of uh, Apache Spark, how it is working, how the internally the in-memory processing take taking place, how it is deferred from the uh, Apache uh, Hadoop and other stuff, right? So you can go through this uh, playlist. Okay, next playlist, I actually uh, developed three projects, end-to-end uh, -end development of uh, three Apache Spark project with uh, other Hadoop ecosystem components or big data ecosystem components like Cassandra, MongoDB, and used uh, uh, Apache Hive and uh, the visualization uh, packages like uh, uh, Dash, Python Dash, and uh, uh, the Super Cert is one of the visualization framework. So all this, uh, using those technologies, I developed a complete three projects. This first project, this is the playlist for first project. Uh, this is the playlist for second project, which is uh, how to get the real-time data and do the processing. Okay, and this is the third project where actually I consume the open source REST API, which is uh, meetup.com's uh, RSVP message. Uh, API and how we can do the real-time processing and uh, build the complete pipeline end-to-end -end, uh, data pipeline using those uh, technologies which is available in the Apache Spark and Hadoop. Okay, this is the uh, third project. You can just go through all this. Uh, I actually explained with each and every code of the uh, project. Okay, and then I have a playlist for the uh, web scraping. Okay, so. Uh, I'm using the uh, framework called Selenium. It's a web framework for uh, uh, um, uh, basically doing the testing. But uh, nowadays we are using for uh, uh, the web, web, web development testing. Uh, Selenium is being used. Now, nowadays we are actually using for the web scraping as well. Okay, so uh, you can explore that. And uh, uh, this is one of the uh, uh, coolest uh, <coughs> playlist where actually you can explore what is data engineering, what uh, to to become a data engineer, what are the things you need to prepare? Uh, all the all the stuff, right? All the all the information about the 
big data technologies which is needed for data engineering i just started with the basic basic so what is data engineering what are the things you need to learn in data engineering everything i put it in this uh, so uh, all this playlist right so this is not actually the just uh, uh, only few right so this this playlist is going to be extensively uh, will be grown uh, uh, I, as i'll keep adding to the videos to this playlist uh, every day or maybe whenever get a time right and uh, this is uh, one of the playlist uh, i started with the machine learning as well so uh, many of the playlist you see the all of uh, big data related and big data engineering related uh, so i started with the playlist uh, on machine learning one out one tutorial where i started with the basics of machine learning and uh, uh, i implemented a, a, a simple linear regression and multiple linear regression so i am going to start with the classification clustering all the stuff in the future okay so so uh, these are the uh, uh, i would say uh, 10 playlist which i uh, given you for uh, uh, quick start with exploring these uh, playlist and uh, learn the technologies uh, apart from this uh, i have uh, i have closely uh, 25 playlist in my um, channel right so all this playlist uh, like uh, apache kafka python and many playlist are there you can just go and explore this uh, Uh, uh technologies and uh, uh, you can practice the programs uh, i put all this uh, uh, s- many of the programs in my blog which is uh, uh, <coughs> uh, datasciencewiki.com so uh, this is my blog where i uh, post all my videos all my uh, uh, code which i used in the videos some of the things i have not added i'm just keep on adding whenever i get time so a little bit of uh, busy with the uh, office work apart from that work i am also probably doing this um, i hope this video is helpful for you to explore the different big data technologies and i am um, al- always there to help you out and you can actually uh, provide your feedbacks uh, on the comment section of each video and you can reach out to me my mail id uh, which is there in my uh, channel uh, uh, <coughs> uh, uh, the contact page okay so you can just uh, come here and uh, you can get my email id you can reach out to me directly okay thank you so much friends uh, uh, i hope in this video i try to cover what are the things there in my youtube channel uh, wish you all the best uh, i'll keep continuing my videos uh, uh, probably the next uh, video series i'm going to start with uh, uh, apache airflow which is uh, airflow which is uh, uh, one of the scheduling uh, uh, framework or tool which is getting popular okay Uh, let's see you in the uh, next video series thank you so much friends